Okay, number four gives you the equation f of x is equal to 5x squared minus 7 parentheses 4x plus 3. It says, what is the value of f at 3? Well, anytime you see this type of notation, all right, all you have to do is plug 3 in place of wherever you have an x value. So what I do is I rewrite my equation, all right, and all the x's I put in parentheses. So we have this plus 3. Okay, now in place of that x, we're going to put a 3. So 5 times 3 squared minus 7 parentheses 4 times 3 plus 3. All right, and you can type all this into uh, a calculator if you have one of the graphing calculators like the TI-84, uh, TI-84 Plus, all right. Uh, if you don't have that kind of calculator, maybe your calculator is only a four-function calculator, uh, then you're going to need to use order of operations, all right. So it would be enough at this step uh, to stop, and you are going to get that your answer is negative 60, Okay, but let's look at how would we use this, all right, using order of operations. So I know that this becomes 5 times 3 squared is 9 minus 7 times, all right, that's 12. 12 plus 3 is 15. So we have 5 times 9 is 45. 45 minus 7 times 15. All right, I'm just going to do this over here. Uh, 10 plus 5, so 70 plus 35, so 105, so 45 minus 105, all right, gives you negative 60, okay? So here we have that this is negative 60.